All right, here's the lore for Capuchin for you. Here's the story of the Capuchin. Last video was really choppy, and I barely could hear my words. So this is a retake. Story. So, this happened like this year. Scientists were trying to create like a lab made human baby. Went wrong, made a uh, capuchin. Well, it's So, started like cloning himself by like eating the humans. So, there they are our ancestors, smarter than us. Because they, some of them ate scientists took on like their IQ. So now they created a lab to try and clone themselves even more because they're running low on capuchin. There's barely any humans left. Actually no more humans. So they tried and created they they created a lab try and created more but created prototype A B don't know who those are that here I'll I'll give you their free prototype A like those regular big boy monkey the um, lab yeah like they were the one with like red eyes and really small prototype A no no that's one like is like really slow that is prototype A strongest but slowest prototype B actually no Prototype A is one of the strongest, slowest. Prototype B, you know how one's like also really fast. Prototype B, one of the fastest, but one of the weakest in strength. But you know, there's one that's really, really fast. That's prototype C. So, fastest and strongest. So, they created prototype A for failed. But they're still neutral. Prototype B, also a failed. Prototype C also a fail until they make tiny one. Let's call the tiny ones greater. So they are they made a successful capuchin, but it was small and it also made going screaming a lot. So they just made it. To, they made it like really big. They thought it would make regular size, but instead they. But they were they were all neutral, and they thought like, oh, they normal. So he they allow like mind. So yeah, then they like they put it on regular, like a uh, medium. So they made a regular one, successful one. Their the smart ones died, so the only ones left were us. Dave shrunk down for some reason. Still in his age, they managed to shrink him down. But for some reason, he's gone bloodthirsty. So that's why he shrunk him down and put him in his cage. But then, he broke out and got his regular size back. Now, he's become, become, has gone rogue, started all capuchin, goes into. Now, Shifting like a static phase, and the Christmas time. So, um, one of the Capuchins started running away from Dave because he went in the mine. Then he saw a cord. So he put the cord in the door that he saw that needed a cord. Went in, saw a tape in his cage, broken. So, grabbed it, put it, placed it in the, they saw as like, the sign, one of the Capuchin scientists, they couldn't, they couldn't speak, so they just wrote down like, the prototypes have gone rogue, help, and then it got corrupted, so, that's the end of the tape, so as he went searching for more things, he saw a vent. And when he went in the vent, that's where he stumbled upon the lab. So, he just like, started like walking around until he saw prototype A. 
that he could easily outrun prototype A, but then saw prototype B, so also ran away from it. Then prototype C. Then, um, the tra traitors. And then, started like, like, destroying him, trying to make more of like, prototypes. Failed. So they're waiting for more normal copy to generate more prototypes. That's all that I have right now. I also know that Dave is an acronym, so I'm just going to try and put it on the video.